I've been waiting for this moment my whole life! SHUT UP! CARTOONS! SHUT UP! SHUT UP! SHUT UP! SHUT UP! SHUT UP! SHUT UP! I think I'm gonna name my kitten Pip, cause he's small like a little pipsqueak. I'm gonna name mine Puddles because he has a urinary tract infection and he pees all the time. I'm gonna name mine Cat so I don't forget his name and stuff. I'm gonna name mine Dog so he has identity and self-confidence issues. And I'm gonna name mine hopefully not ever near me at any time because I'm allergic and if I'm near one I die. Wait. What the mm -hmm. f is everyone? Aliens must have taken them. My mom told me this would happen. Quick, get under the table! We're all gonna die and stuff! Mm -hmm. Uh, guys? Everyone is just outside. Looks like they're cohabitating in small groups. And playing games? What is that? It's called recess. Three times a day you have to go out and rub butts with each other in the great outdoors or we get in trouble. Rub butts? That sounds like my uncle's prison yard. This shit's crazy! Yeah, I mean, what are we supposed to even do out here? We can always just hide out in the dog loo until recess is over. I think we need to define ourselves in a subset or click so we don't become vulnerable to attack from outside forces. Okay, Hector, how do we do that? Hey, how come you gotta ask that one stereotypical not white gangster character about how to survive in a prison like environment? Uh, because you just said you had uncles in prison, duh. No, I didn't. Yeah, you did. And you're actually FaceTiming with them right now. Hey guys! We are in fact both Hector and Singh's uncles. And very proud of that fact. Wait, why are your uncles in prison nerdy white guys? They're not nerds! Then what are they in for? We can handle this. We unfortunately got caught selling vegetarian flan to a group of vegans. I have no idea what that means, but it sounds like a nerd crime. But they did it over the internet using Groupons and stuff! Nerd crime. They were all wearing black locally sourced cotton ski masks! Nerd crime. Fine, whatever, do you want their help or not? Well, it's either that or we have to hang out in the dog loo. Too late. Fucking bees! They're always stealing all the cool places to hang out in. Okay, so first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna find the toughest gang in the yard and then kill one of them. Make sure it's very quick and very bloody so everyone can see you're the ones not to be fucked with. Uh, I don't think we want to kill anyone. You think we could just hug them instead? I like the hugging idea. Ooh, we can even do it kind of tightly if you want to show them who's boss. Wait, you mean to shake them, right? Yes. Fuck yeah! Don't worry guys, I got this one! I've been waiting for this moment my whole life! Shank, 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 shank! So, how are things going with the ladies, Sing? Uh... You still got that girlfriend in Poland? That ultra rich supermodel who wants to marry you and stuff? Uh. Wait, Sing, you have a girlfriend? You never told us about her. What kind of model is she? Hand model? No. Foot model? No. Butt model? <laughs> No! I wish I was a butt model. I'd get to wear all types of pants and sometimes shorts, I bet. Look, I lied about Pretty Monica the genius model, okay? I don't have a girlfriend. I've never had one. I'm a loser and I've never even held hands with a girl before. Psh, so what? We like you either way, Sing. Yeah, we're your real friends and we love and respect you no matter what. Really? Yeah, duh. In that case, do you want to be my girlfriend? F no, nerd baby. This is really awkward. Yeah, how's the shanking going, Hector? What happened? No one would let me shank them. That makes sense. Sounds pretty scary. You should have just done it! You can't ask for shank permission. You just gotta do that shit. But that wouldn't be polite. So? Look, man, even if you're trying to end some puto motherfucker's life with a handcrafted razor-sharp stabbing instrument, you at least gotta have some decorum. And the kid's right. Maybe that's why no one here likes us. And tries to kill us all the time. Yeah, maybe if you were more polite with your violence, it would all work out. Thanks for trying to help us, though. Maybe we should try it out. Yeah, you're right. Excuse me, sir, is it okay if I shank you? But of course, it's so nice of you for politely asking. Oh, let me do it. Hello there, friend. Is it okay if I shank you to death? Oh. Wait, Elliot? Are you okay? Don't move. You're gonna get a life sentence for brutally killing him like that. But I was polite about it. I learned it from my baby nephew. Taze his ass. <laughs> Well, that was, uh... Yeah. How did your uncles get a phone into prison anyway? Shit, I don't know, man. Maybe they had it sent by balloon or a really nice carrier pigeon. Actually, they said they had to sneak them inside in their asses, then pull it out by hand. I don't think I want to go to prison. Yeah, me neither.